13 Most Important Friends with Benefits Rules You Need to Know for a Smooth Experience Let's face it, friends with benefits, FWB, arrangements, are the perfect solution when you're looking for intimacy without the emotional drama. You get to have fun with someone you trust, enjoy each other's company, and still maintain your independence. Sounds great, right? But before you dive into this seemingly carefree scenario, it's important to understand the unspoken rules of the game. Without these guidelines, things can easily get complicated. So, if you want your FWB situation to run smoothly, here are the 13 most important rules you absolutely need to follow. 1. Don't have a FWB with someone already involved. This might sound like a no-brainer, but it's worth emphasizing. Don't get involved with someone who is already in a relationship or a FWB with someone else. Why? The risk of jealousy and drama increases exponentially, and that's the exact opposite of what you want in an FWB arrangement. While you might think you're mature enough to handle it, remember that a third party's feelings can complicate everything. Trust me, it's not worth the risk. 2. Never get involved with a good friend. This is one of the most important friends with benefits rules. You may think that because you're close friends, things won't get awkward or complicated, but studies suggest otherwise. Emotions can easily get involved when you're spending intimate time with someone you care about. If one of you starts catching feelings, it's likely to cause friction and can ultimately destroy the friendship. Stick to people you aren't already emotionally invested in to avoid unnecessary complications. 3. Avoid personal or emotional discussions. Keep things light, fun, and emotionally detached. The more you open up to your FWB, the higher the chances of developing a deeper emotional connection. And while that might seem harmless at first, it can lead to unwanted attachment. Avoid prying into their personal life and setting the expectation of emotional support. Set clear boundaries and respect them. Both of you need to avoid the temptation to turn this into something more than it is. 4. Say no to sleepovers. It might feel comfortable to spend the night together after some fun, but trust me, sleepovers are a dangerous territory. When you wake up next to someone, it starts to trigger emotional responses. The casual nature of the FWB arrangement gets complicated when one of you starts feeling too cozy or invested. Always make it a point to part ways after the fun, or at the very least, sleep in separate places. This helps maintain the boundaries of the relationship. 5. Don't leave stuff behind. Leaving things at each other's places is a slippery slope. It may seem innocent, just a toothbrush here or a shirt there, but before you know it, you're spending more time at each other's places, and the boundaries you set at the start are blurred. Remember, you're friends with benefits, not a couple. Keep your things separate, and avoid any behavior that suggests you're becoming too comfortable in each other's spaces. 6. Less contact is good. The more you communicate outside of your FWB arrangements, the more likely you are to develop feelings. Keep texts and calls to a minimum. Use them only for logistical reasons, like setting up your next meetup or cancelling plans. Cute texts, checking in on each other, or sharing personal details will create a deeper connection. If you're texting each other frequently, you might unintentionally be shifting into romantic territory. 7. Avoid cuddling. Yes, cuddling might seem harmless, but it's one of the easiest ways to complicate things emotionally. When you cuddle, you're opening the door to affection that might suggest you're more than just friends. FWB relationships work best when you keep things simple, sexual but non-committal. Cuddling or any other intimate gestures outside of sex can easily lead to attachment, so it's best to avoid them altogether. 8. Be open about your sexual fantasies. The whole point of having a FWB is to enjoy great, no-strings-attached sex. To ensure that both parties are satisfied, be open about your sexual needs and fantasies. 
If there's something you've always wanted to try, communicate that to your FWB. This isn't the time to hold back. After all, the arrangement is based on mutual pleasure. Just make sure your FWB is comfortable with your suggestions and be receptive to theirs. 9. Groom yourself. Even though you're not in a relationship, that doesn't mean you should let your personal grooming slip. Common courtesy applies. If you expect your FWB to be looking their best for you, make sure you do the same. Whether it's shaving, grooming, or dressing in a way that shows you care, a little effort goes a long way in ensuring that both of you are comfortable and confident during your time together. 10. Don't be clingy. One of the core benefits of a FWB arrangement is that you get to enjoy intimacy without the emotional clinginess of a typical relationship. Your FWB is there for sex, not for fulfilling your emotional needs. If you start demanding attention, affection, or regular contact outside of the arrangement, it defeats the entire purpose. If you find yourself seeking more than just casual fun, it's time to step back and reassess what you're really looking for. 11. Be understanding if your friend meets someone. The reality is, your FWB is free to date other people, and eventually, they might find someone they want to pursue a serious relationship with. If this happens, be prepared for the FWB arrangement to come to an end. Don't take it personally. Relationships, whether romantic or platonic, evolve. If your FWB starts seeing someone else, respect their decision and move on gracefully. If you're unable to accept this, then maybe a FWB relationship isn't for you. 12. Go and date. Just because you're having sex with someone doesn't mean you're in a relationship. You're allowed to date other people too. However, make sure to be upfront about your FWB situation early on when you start dating someone else. Lying or withholding information about your arrangement can lead to serious complications and hurt feelings. The earlier you are transparent, the better it is for everyone involved. 13. Know when to end it. The most important rule of all. Know when to end it. No matter how well you follow these rules, there's a good chance that one of you will start catching feelings for the other. If that happens, it's better to end the FWB situation before it turns into something more complicated or painful. If emotions start to get in the way, talk about it openly, and if necessary, cut ties completely. A FWB arrangement can be a great experience, but only if both parties can keep their emotions in check. Final Thoughts Friends with benefits can be an exhilarating and satisfying arrangement if you follow these 13 essential rules. However, you must stay vigilant about the boundaries you've set from the beginning. If at any point it starts to feel like something more, reassess your situation and have an honest conversation with your FWB. Remember, it's all about mutual respect, clear communication, and maintaining that sense of freedom that drew you to the arrangement in the first place. Stick to these guidelines, and your FWB experience can be everything you want it to be. Fun, uncomplicated, and enjoyable. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comment section down below, and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end. Also make sure to check out our next highlighted video, and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.